What's up, guys? Matt Brown here for PlayPicks.com and TheLines.com. Going to talk a little bit about Major League Baseball MLB betting here. Of course, you can head over to the lines and you can see right here. I mean, when you click on these, we've got pages for all the big events that are coming up. Betting frequently asked questions. So if you have any questions about anything that I'm talking about here, just head right over, click, and there'll be tons of different information on here. Videos as well as written content about what you can look for when you're trying to place pretty much any sort of bet for any sort of sport. And of course, if you want to go to play picks, one of the things we have playpicks.com forward slash bonus. And when you get that, this is just the very best offers you're going to find in all of sportsbook and DFS. So right now you can see $25 absolutely free at DraftKings. We have tons of offers at bet stars, fan 888 sugar house, even points bet and Golden Nugget, where you're getting free money for signing up just using our links here. Of course, these are exclusive to us, so you're going to want to use those. And, of course, DFS offers as well. So talk a little bit about baseball betting. We'll click over to DraftKings Sportsbook here, and we're clicking on a game that's just going happens to be going off uh, later, the e- later this evening. One of the most common bets that you guys are probably very familiar with is just money line bet. This is just the team to win the game. So right here, the Boston Red Sox are favored in this game against the Oakland Athletics. They are minus 175. You would have to bet $175 to get $100 back. So the minus sign tells you how much you have to bet to win $100. The plus sign here for the Oakland Athletics, plus 148, comes in as what your return would be on a $100 bet. They are the underdog, so a $100 bet will return your original $100 plus $148, so $248 total. So that's a money line bet, how you bet baseball if you just want to bet on who is going to win. Now, baseball is typically bet on the money line because uh, we talk about spreads, and of course, if you don't know what a spread is, going back to the lines over here, there's all kinds of explanations here, point spread betting. You could click on that and take a look there. But it's called a run line in baseball, and it's because, you know, baseball is a low-scoring game. And so you're not going to see, like in basketball and football and uh, the games like that, where, you know, spreads can get upwards of double digits. Well, you know, that's just not how baseball is done. So you have a run line here. So a run line is always going to be one and a half. They just change the juice on it, and that's how they decipher uh, how, how this goes. So Red Sox are favored here. So they are favored by a run and a half. So they have to win by a run and a half. If you wanted to bet the run line and it's minus one Oh seven, actually. So you are going to have to bet $107 to win a hundred on this. The athletics are actually the dog here. So they are plus one and a half runs. And to win that, as long as they keep it within one run, you bet $109 and you would win hundred dollars there again much more common in baseball to bet money lines than it is to bet run lines but it is an option if you want to bet another way you can bet here is just the total or the over under it would be similar to how you if you've ever bet a total or an over under on a football game or a basketball game this is just happens to be the runs scored in the baseball game so in this instance right here the number is eight in this particular game if you took the over and nine runs were scored you would win if you took the over and seven runs scored you would lose if you took the under here same deal nine runs scored you would lose seven runs scored you would win and since this doesn't have a hook or a half point or a half run on it then if it landed directly on eight it would be a push and you would just be returned your bet you can see on DraftKings though there are several other bets that you can make here they have first three innings first five innings first five innings is actually a fairly popular baseball bet as well if you really like the starter in a game and you kind of want to take the bullpen out of the equation this is where the first five inning bet comes in so you can see right here for the Red Sox to be leading after the first five innings minus 122 for the Oakland Athletics to be leading after the first five innings plus 180 and for it to be a tie after five innings you can get plus 460 on this they have all kinds of other uh of of other ways that you can play here of course they have alternative lines if you want to go that route alternative run lines if you want to go that route as well they also have just parlays and then they have player props so this is a home run and a team to win so Chris Davis Uh, Of course, a really, really big home run hitter there for the Oakland A's. For him to hit a home run and the A's to win, plus 900. And you can see the odds get greater as you go down to guys that are less likely to hit 
uh, home runs for on that team there. And then you can get down here to the favored team, which is the Red Sox and J.D. Martinez, to hit a home run and for them to win only plus 450 there. They have players just to hit a home run overall. So this is just Chris Davis to hit a home run in this game, period. You would get plus 375 if you bet yes. You would get minus 560 if you bet no. And, of course, that just goes down for the rest of these players over here. And then the pitchers in this game, you can see Chris Sale, Mike Fires. You can uh, see that the strikeout total for Chris Sale, 8.5. You can bet the over there and get plus 115. You can bet the under, get minus 143. And then, of course, there are just game props as well. You can take a look at all the different game props here, and these will vary game to game. Sometimes there'll be more, sometimes there'll be less, depending on what it'll be. First team to score, you can bet different uh, things like that as well, all the way down to first team to score two runs, to first team to score four, five, et cetera, et cetera. Team with the highest scoring innings. So you can see uh, DraftKings really giving you several, several different ways that you can bet a baseball game. Now, one of the other ways that you can bet as well, if we just click the MLB tab up here, you can see right here, these are games that are going on currently. So live wagering. And again, if you don't know what in-play wagering is, go back to the lines, go to betting, frequently asked questions, and you can click in-play betting right here, and you will get a full look at it, just exactly what is in-play in betting. And you can also watch the video where there's an explanation as well. But let's click on, let's just say we're going down here. We want to uh, bet in-play on this Twins and Royals game here. So you can see this game is in the fourth inning. And since this, uh, since the Royals are up a run here, you can see that they are actually favored in the game with just a one run run line. The total has been adjusted because of the way that this game is pacing. And then the money line adjusted as well for the way that the game sits right now. And again, this is constantly changing throughout the game, throughout the game. And you'll be able to take advantage of how these things might go. If you think the twins would want to come are going to come back and win here, despite the fact that they're down a run in the fourth inning, then you could take the money line and actually get plus money where they were actually uh, the favorite in this game with before the game stopped. I mean, before the game started, you can look here again, same deal. They have alternate run lines just like they do in, um, before the game starts and then live inning props, you can take a look at how this would go, uh, you know, a hit by any by by the away team. So this would be the Minnesota Twins. You can actually bet per inning, whether there'll be a hit, whether there'll be the most hits uh, run scored or not. So they give you tons of ways to get action down in the game as well. Of course, game props as well, just like we saw before these games get started. So tons and tons of ways that you can bet in game as well. We'll click the MLB tab here and go back down. But again, as you see, um, let's just, you know, again, we'll click on this game that has not started yet. The most popular way that baseball is bet is on the money line. And that is just for the team to win or lose. It doesn't have to win or it doesn't have to win or lose by any certain number. It is just whether that team leaves the game, the winner. And uh, again, minus means the favorite plus means the underdog. The minus means what you would have to bet to win $100. The plus is your return on a $100 bet. Second most popular bet would be the run total over unders here. And then third would be the run line as well. Of course, you can bet the first five innings. If you want to take away any of the uncertainty that may come with some of these teams bullpens. So you can just bet who is going to be leading after the first five innings. Again, guys, head over to the lines. And as we said, just on top of all of the stuff we have going on with just the industry news here, uh, great information on frequently asked questions. If you don't know what any of these terms are, we have uh, written content as well as video stuff. Uh, great podcast each and every week that is uh, letting people know what's going on in the industry. And if you go to playpicks.com forward slash bonus, you can take advantage of any of these offers that's going on. Uh, sports betting offers that are going on over there in New Jersey. Again, you don't have to be a resident of New Jersey. You just have to be physically located within the border. So if you're heading over there anytime soon, uh, be sure and take advantage of some of these offers here. And of course, we've got DFS offers where you can do that in most states in the U.S. as well. Thanks a lot for watching. Be sure and like the video and subscribe to the page.